Ed Gein was a notorious serial killer and body snatcher who lived in the rural town of Plainfield, Wisconsin, during the 1950s. Despite his small stature and unassuming appearance, Ed was known to be one of the most sadistic and twisted individuals ever walking the earth. His dark and twisted crimes shocked the nation and forever changed how we view serial killers. Ed was born in 1906 to a deeply religious family who believed that all women were evil and that sex was a sin. His mother, Augusta, was a devout Baptist who ruled the household with an iron fist. Augusta taught her children that all women, except for her, were the spawn of the devil and that their bodies were the vessels of sin. As a young man, Ed was never entirely comfortable around women as a young man and kept to himself most of the time. He lived on the family farm with his brother Henry and his mother Augusta, his only source of comfort and companionship. When Ed was in his mid-twenties, his brother died in a mysterious accident, and his mother passed away a few years later from a stroke. With no one to care for him, Ed became increasingly isolated and began to experience vivid hallucinations. He became obsessed with bringing his mother back to life and started to exhume graves in search of bodies to use in his macabre experiments. Ed's first known crime occurred in 1954 when he was caught stealing a body from a local cemetery. The police were shocked to find that Ed had taken the body and used it to fashion a life-size doll that he had dressed in women's clothing. It wasn't long after this incident that a local hardware store owner went missing. The authorities searched Ed's farm and were horrified by what they found. The farm was littered with human bones and body parts, and in the basement, they discovered a collection of grotesque objects, including furniture and clothing made from human skin. Ed had been killing local women and using their bodies to make his twisted creations. He had made everything from lampshades to belts out of human skin and had even fashioned a mask from a female head. The authorities arrested Ed and charged him with murder, and he was quickly put on trial. Despite the overwhelming evidence against him, Ed maintained his innocence and refused to speak about his crimes. He was found guilty of multiple counts of murder and was sentenced to life in prison. Ed's crimes inspired numerous horror movies and books, including the classic film Psycho by Alfred Hitchcock. Despite his infamy, Ed's life was tragic, and he remained one of the most fascinating and twisted individuals in American history. Ed spent the rest of his life in prison, where he died of cancer in 1984 at 77. His legacy, however, continues to live on, as he remains one of the most notorious serial killers of all time. Ed Gein's Ed's crimes were a testament to the deep and twisted darkness within the human soul. His story serves as a reminder of the evil that can be found in the most unlikely places and the dangers of isolation and extreme religious beliefs. Thanks for watching.